Okay. 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 Five, four, three, two, one. Hello, everybody. Hello, nation, YouTubers. Twitch. And SoundClouders. Happy Halloween to United States. No, it's not Halloween. It's Thanksgiving. <laughs> <laughs> I screw up again. Holy fuck. Oh. Happy Halloween. <laughs> Happy Black uh, Saturday. <laughs> Happy Black Friday. Happy Halloween. I mean... <laughs> Happy Thanksgiving Gobble Gobble Day for you guys. For us, normal Tuesday. And also, we're going to take three weeks off to give everyone a heads Ye up after this episode. Yes, we're going to want today. we freaking drinking. My favorite beer, Zodiac, with the alien beer, with the alien, all alien stuff. If you see it, everything. We have a star. Yeah, you we see a alien, fucking uh, pyramid. sperm. Uh oh. We got the a, guy who don't we got a, alien. a ladder, we ladder to erect them. We got a butt plug. We got a nice multiple head the, the, dildo. The guy is so flat, like he thinks <sighs> the earth is flat. Mm hmm. I'm thinking. Aliens is everywhere. Go for aliens. <laughs> give and a, give a poly cracker. Yeah, and it's Thanksgiving in the All States. All right, Thanksgiving in the States. That's why we have a beard here. That's the gobble gobble. We save him. Second year on a row, we save our angry beard, which is miniature version of uh, radioactive turkey. So we say he's, he's a radioactive. Yeah, turkey. he was uh, he was uh, disposed, uh, you know, to the aliens. Okay. Uh, uh, Et said to him, "I'm going home, mm -hmm. <laughs> and you are not with me if you're too big." Mm -hmm. And he said, "Okay, I'm gonna jump to the batteries by Tesla factory," and he became little. His name is Angry Beard. Mm -hmm. Ready? I don't know what is the red name guy. Oh. You remember from Angry Birds? They're all Angry Birds. No, they have like names. Who oh, I don't know. There was a movie they I made. I know there was a movie. No, what the fuck? I we should update it. them. What? I didn't watch it. That's terrible. That was Why the fuck would I watch Angry Birds? Because you're angry human. You should watch Angry Birds. Who the your fuck life? is going to watch what Angry Birds? Hell? Okay, say hello to Mike. Uh... uh yeah, your favorite guy. Yeah. You don't even know his name. No, because he have this mic producer, yeah. Yeah. Thank you for uh, say hello to uh, us about this. Yeah, but so said, far, nothing... He said, good luck on your Cadillac dealership. You totally, Used dealership. You to totally forgot you even talked about that. No, no, I, I knew it right away because you said, oh, how did I? and I say probably I was talking about Cadillacs because that's the moment. Uh, update, so far nothing. No shit. Still speaking. <laughs> Oh, job. Do not make move yet, Mike. So uh, soon I'm gonna do something. I let you know. Thank you for mention. I can't believe it. You even watch our show. So that's very big. Awesome. Well, we put his name in the title. So oh, yeah, okay, he whatever. Would probably watch the show. Y yes, but uh, yeah. Good luck uh, with your productions, and I hope you're gonna make some good shows so we can laugh too. Because so far, uh, it's nothing in Hollywood right now what is make us laugh. That's why we came here and make our program. So, yeah. thank you very much, Mike. If something happened, we let you know. That's probably be 2020. Right before, we're going to find out that the, uh, <laughs> it's going to be the end of the world. Because uh, Elon Musk said maybe. Yeah. And he's escaping to the... Mars? Yeah, you're watching too much stuff. <laughs> it's, it's amazing. So anyway, thank you very much for the match. Okay, now, first, first news. What's going on? All right, that's an awesome news. <laughs> fucking, that was speed of the light. Fucking guy have, how old do you know? 23? Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes in the video, maybe they see 32, but you're actually 23. And soon you're going to be your fucking big birthday. 24. Mm -hmm. Wow. Wow. <laughs> when the last time your mother called you? How old you was? You uh, tell the number. 30? Uh, what did she say? 34? 
No, not 34. What'd she say, 24? She thought I was like, uh... Okay, come on, come on, let's go. I think like tw 25. Okay, so... And when um... I when I was turning 23. Some bullshit Okay, like so n when did you gonna be 25, she gonna be finally right? Out of two times, she Very got... Good she... Beard, so yeah, yeah. For the two Out times... Out of two times, she didn't even know how old I was. <laughs> She lose track for she vagina. She lose track. Yeah. 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 When this happened? Well, <laughs> too much drugs she, that day. She lost her brain a long time ago. Oh. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right. So anyway. Anyway, uh, Chris, Chris, Chris D'Elia's girlfriend. Chris okay, I'm talking. <laughs> Chris D'Elia's girlfriend, Takashi Six Nine. Yes. Is going to jail for life. Who? Six Nine. Yeah. Has been arrested. Yes. And he's going to jail for life. No, for life. For 10 years. Maybe. No, it's not. Yeah, they say already today for was life. bond. And maybe they're going to release him. There's no his... bond. Yeah, because There's he no is bail. in big danger over there. There's no bail. Yes, it is. No, it's Where not. Where did you see this? I'm going to explain the whole situation Okay, to you. come on. Come on. Okay? I know everything about this. 6 case. 9 yes, the is facing case. jail time for involvement in gang violence in New York City. He faces 32 years in jail for a thing called racketeering. Racketeering! Which was what racketeering means? Racketeering means basically... Hey, Siri. What does racketeering mean? Racketeering means dishonest and fraudulent business dealings. Ooh, he... Some business. I have like a more detailed Okay, go ahead. Go it. ahead. Discretion. So basically he was involved with a gang called the Nine Trey Bloods. I was which, thinking 96. Which was he was part of the Bloods, which is one of the biggest gangs in the world. Really? Yes, there's Bloods and there's Crips. Oh yeah, that's in the United States. Yeah. They're, Why are you saying no, war? Because they're all over the world. There's members all over the world. The black people everywhere? There's probably like... At least, like, probably, like, tens of thousands of Bloods and tens and thousands of Crips everywhere. What a it's the gay biggest fucking name, Crips and Bloods. It's the biggest gangs in the yeah, world. Yeah, but that's so gayish. I mean, yeah. like, I would be saying, like, freaking, you know, like, whoa, something very, like, uh, I'm like Panthers or something, you know, or something. No, Black Panthers is different. That's yeah, like, but uh, I know, but the sounds better. Activist group. Yeah. For black people. Yeah, but like I said, I know, I know, but like the freaking Crips and Bloods. What the hell is the name? Yeah, of that Crips for? and Bloods. Well, the biggest water. gangs. Tic Tacs and fucking M and M's. No. Fucking okay. Anyway, keep going. So. So basically, he got arrested for racketeering. Which is, yeah, is when people use criminal action to repeatedly take money from others. And most likely associated with protecting rackets. If that makes sense. I don't know if that uh, makes sense. Protect rackets? So basically they just do a bunch of criminal actions to take money from other people. Yeah, like, you know, like, the they uh, come and say, you need a... Uh, you need security in your guys. store? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, yes, you do. Yes, you do. You or, have to give us two grand, grand a hospital. month. Oh, okay. How yeah. much? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Two grand I like a month. sex. <laughs> I, it's nice. I like it. How much? Yeah. So this is where 6 9 fucked up. I like him. My favorite song, Chocolate. In 2015, he pled guilty to an incident involving a sexual performance with a 13-year-old girl. What? Where did he find this shit? He was 12, probably. No. He <laughs> would have been 21 years old at the time. Because he's 25 now. So, basically, he was doing a sexual performance on a 13-year-old girl. How does this mean, performance? Performance, maybe giving her a lap dance on the stage. Oh, fuck. What the fuck maybe is this? Maybe touching the 13-year-old's butthole. But maybe he didn't know she was 13 years old. Listen, you shouldn't, you shouldn't old... even be... Touching people sexually oh, if you do don't you, even know oh, them. Before even some, something happened, before I forget, yeah? Okay. In your news, you have the Pusha T story from Toronto? No, because everyone talked about that already. Oh, I don't okay. want to talk Because I watched it. yesterday. Really I know. What happened. Everyone talked Holy about it. Holy fuck. Yeah. Holy, he, they beat him up big time. I mean... They didn't beat him up, he ran away. Yeah. His but... security... Was beating the shit out of the crowd. No, no, the crowd beat up the security. No, the security was fucked big. Them up. Fuck no! I watch everything on TMZ. I yeah. see it. 
Holy but I'm shit. not and talking he, about that. I'm talking about six nine. Key? I'm talking about six nine right now. Okay, sorry. I was okay. going to jail for life. No, he's not. Yes, he good. is. Thirty two years in jail for racketeering. Yeah, thirty two. That's the life. That is life. Life is considered twenty five years. What? No, no. Life is like life. You no, know, you a life. No, a life sentence is considered twenty five years. How old he is now? He's twenty five. Oh, after behave, he's gonna be ten years old. No. He right. literally has to sit 32 years before even being considered to leave or not. No. For parole. I tell you right because now. Because he broke his probation. He had a four-year probation because he was fucking sexually doing performance on a 13-year-old girl in oh, 2015. That, that should be thrown away because he couldn't say, I don't know what she was talking. Anyway, who cares? No. Next one. No, no, keep next going. One. Next, That's it for this jail thing? No. Okay, keep going. So basically... He was supposed to have a brand new album that was supposed to come out tomorrow. Yes. Which was Friday. On yes. Black Friday, yes. it was supposed to be a brand new 6 9 album coming out. And no coming? And now it's not coming out. Why? Because he's in, he's in jail. So what does that have to do with his business? Bro? Because his whole team, including him, got arrested for it. He fired everybody. No. See, this is where he fucked up. This is this is my conspiracy behind it. So yeah. he he knew this was gonna happen, hands down. There's a reason. He started filming the music videos, and there were shootings at the different music videos. I know the guy was through the fence. I see this video. Yeah. Put the gun okay. and start shooting on them. How they make video? So Where's the fifty cents? So now six nine is like, oh fuck, I'm gonna get fucked because of this. Yeah. So, what he did was, okay, I'm going to fire my whole team so people won't get in shit. Less people to get in shit. So he'll take the shit. Then he went on Breakfast Club four or five days ago. Did a full, he literally did a full hour and 20 minute yeah, interview. Just, uh, literally the day before he so got can... arrested by the feds. And he was talking about, in that interview, how the FBI was investigating him and that he was literally sitting at home crying. And he fired the whole team before. He was saying because it was like shady promoters oh, ripping he said he him can't off. trust nobody. He was saying basically the pro his rate for concerts was $100,000 he has to make for every concert. That's his rate. But these promoters were booking him in venues where he was only getting $60,000 per venue because they were saying he was high risk because of his gang-related shit. Oh, that's true. So they were saying we need more security, more this, yeah, more yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. So they were. that's why he fired them. He's basically like, you're just cutting my normal rate for no reason. He's like, I've never had an incident at a concert or any problems at a concert. Everything that happens to me is outside of a concert. Okay, so? So basically, I think 6 9 knew the whole time that he was going to go, go to jail. Because he was talking about how he was getting prosecuted before for the 13-year-old girl. And he was lucky he didn't go to jail for that. And he was saying, imagine if I go to jail now. He's like, I'm at the peak. And I'm going to go to jail. He's like, that would be fucked. And it happened. And he's right now with uh, Bill Cosby. And uh, another uh, very famous people over there. Yeah, thir fucking 32 years in jail. I don't think it's going to happen. Right. It right. already happened. No, no, but they said they already, already arrested yesterday him. On PMZ, they said. Yeah, they already arrested him. He's already basically in jail at this Brooklyn point. Joe. Yeah. And he was supposed to have brand new album with fucking. He had a song with Kanye West and Nicki Minaj on the new album. Song with Tory Lanez. Song with this guy. Song with this guy. Okay, so they whole do, brand new I know, album. I know what they're gonna do. That was supposed to come now out. This, of, listen, now they're gonna do it opposite. Kanye West will be released, and the funds gonna go to his account. That's it. No, I know, I know how they're gonna that help him. Project is basically scrap. Now. No way. Yeah, because they can't release it. 
his fucking the guy who runs his record label also got arrested with the same charges yeah, he's too. Yeah, or whatever. Yeah, they say something. And all the management guys. Yeah. It was seven of them. They all got arrested for all the same shit. That's a terrible last for beautiful rap city of. Yeah. I hope Takeshi, listen, I'm big fan. I don't give a shit what's going on. Life is too short. So whatever you do, try get out and make music. I like your music. It's 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 different kind of music. I know it's a lot of violence, blah blah blah, but I know it's it's cool. You have very good voice. You know, and uh, Mike uh, from <laughs> what's his name, producer. You should sign this guy all the time. Even he have these problems, whatever. But it look like he he have like like he said he have no good nobody to good trust everybody and probably this people actually around him make this shit happen with your what do you call this word racketeering racketeering I think so they fucked up and he have to pay for this but he have good maybe lawyers and they gonna finally find out. It wasn't him. He, he just sing and fucking whatever, you know, he doing. And then he will be no stupid. Like you said, he said he don't want to go to the jail on the pig of this. He probably was doing everything and they was fucking around, screwing up, tipping FBI, putting everything, everything on him. And that's why he ended up fucking in jail. FBI is fucking the stupid fucking uh, shit in the planet over there. It's it's. It's overreacting with everything to fucking cops is like fucking robots. Everybody fucking scared everybody. They doing everything with this tail on the uh, like on the, your uh, uh, you know like followed by rules. They tell you rules. <clears throat> Some stupid cops even sell. They ask you like you go for a police uh, fucking test and they ask if your mother became crime. And you fucking see this. Did you gonna report this? And the stupid, they, they want you to say, yeah, I'm gonna report it, but I, I'm gonna treat her like my mother, go to the jail and everything. You're gonna report your mother. First, you're gonna say, what the fucking happened? What happened? You make yourself an investigation. You know, report fucking know your member, member of family to fucking for crime. That's where the shit getting wrong, fucking. You should fucking... At least she killed somebody. Then you report it. But fucking anything else is fucking bullshit. So fu you can always fix. You can always work. Stealing. Why? Uh, anything fucking different shit. Cops is so... F you know what? Fucking they should... Every cop became cop. Should go to army. At least for two years. Fucking Afghanistan. Then they realize common sense. Come back. And then they're gonna fucking be on the street and they're gonna see, you know what? I see unbelievable shit. That shit is not big deal. Fuck it. At least, you know, you catch the same guy three times or something. Fucking do it. Crazy thing. Then you give him a little fine. But fuck this shit. This, this, this cop's shit. That's, you know, the every FBI, the bullshit, everything. You should be fucking and don't shoot people. Fucking Chicago. They yeah, shoot, they shot in the hospital. They shot the fuck. No, no, that's after. But that security guy who fucking come call catch the oh, guy who yeah. try shoot everybody, pointing gun, have the security somehow fucking vest, and they say yeah he didn't have it. Fucking bullshit, bullshit, bullshit. You know, blue family. We have to protect you. Fucking became fucking. You know, in my eyes, you became the same fucking... As gangs. Gangs, just you untouchable because you're behind the law. That's a bullshit unbelievable. If you, something happened, if you, they see he shot, fucking... That's it, out of the force. I don't fucking care. You know shooting and asking questions after. First, you shoot uh, asking questions. <laughs> you don't shoot and ask questions after. First, you shoot. <laughs> Poor guy, fucking unbelievable. Young prospect, he won't be caught. See that the guy was believing. You hired the retards, somebody who know or something. Never fucking was in army. 
He gonna shoot because he have a gun. Fuck, stupid. Ay, ay, ay. That's it. Oh, make me upset. Yeah. All right. Next fucking bullshit. I'm sorry, Rakishi. Fucking good luck. Rakishi. Was he Takishi? Whatever his name. Takashi six nine. Takashi six nine. Man, we waiting. Good luck, man. Fucking. We're gonna be waiting a long time. No, fuck. shut up. Th I like him. Thirty two years. No fucking. I, they gonna find out these other people fucked up because this both and fifty cent. <sighs> his almost father. He gonna fucking find out what the fucking happened. Fifty so cent. Far, go no to work. Thank you. Bye. Okay, that's it. Next one. Next fucking shit. What? Scientist. Oh fuck. Who? What scientist? Did a breakthrough discovery. But before I explain it, do you know what a wombat is? Wombat? bat? A wombat. Some kind of bat? No, a wombat. Like you're walking something? No. A bat like. It's an animal. Like a flying bat? No. Okay, so what the fuck a wombat is? You drive me nuts. It looks like a giant fucking hamster. <laughs> <laughs> With wings? No. It's just a giant fucking hamster. Okay, how big is the hamster? Pretty fucking big. How big? Cut size? Ask Siri what a wombat is. Hey Siri. What is a wombat? Yes. They are about one meter in length with small, stubby tails. There are three extant species and they are all members of the family of Wombatidae. Why is it that phone talking? And are found in forested, mountainous, and heatland areas of southeastern Australia, <laughs> including Tasmania, this as well as an isolated patch of about 300 hectares in Epping Forest National Park in central Queensland. They're basically one meter long hamsters. They're giant hamsters. Okay? Yeah, okay, so one meters giant ham look like a fucking neutra. Like what uh, the like, fuck is a neutra? Uh, look like a beaver. No. With the it long looks tail. like a hamster. I like a big hamster on steroid. But did you know no. <laughs> that when they poop What the fuck <laughs> no? It's cube shaped. Like a squirt? Yes. They're the only animal on the planet. That poops cubes. That's interesting. Yes, it is. His 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 asshole, the pipe, have to be like a cubing, so they shape the cubes. Mm -hmm. That's interesting. So, where are you going? I'm trying to explain to you wombat shit. I know. And you walk away. Keep no, I have to talk to you. <laughs> Cube shit! Yeah, why are you running away? <laughs> yeah, cube shit. Cube shit. <laughs> okay. So, basically, the wombat can pass up to a hundred pieces of cube shit per night. Hundred. Hundred. So it's just a pile of cubes that come out of his butthole. Holy mackerel. And they use the piles to mark their territories. Yeah, yeah. Wow, you really don't know how to pour beer. That's a lot of foam now. Yeah, but I knew it was nothing now. He said he's no alien. He's crazy. The microphone is here. He is crazy. <laughs> so, basically, a bunch of scientists found... Oh, okay, let's see. Bunch of scientists. Yeah. They came bunch of... Yeah, a group of them were how like... How many is bunch? We need to figure out... Yeah, how much is a bunch? I think there's more than three people. It's usually 12. Hey, Suri. How much is bunch people? Okay. I found this on the web for how much is a bunch of people. Take a look. Yeah, I actually knew what you said. <laughs> for the... Uh... Eight is better than six. This guy didn't even click me on what I said. So how much is a bunch? What does it say? But just come on. Yeah, bunch definition: a connected group, cluster, a bunch of grapes. Okay, so that's it. Yeah, it's like a group. Yeah, like grapes. 
Yeah, like grapes. A bunch of grapes got together. Yeah, like the hanging, you know, like grapes yeah, right yeah. on the one piece. Yeah. That's a bunch of people. Okay. Well. So the scientists <laughs> grabbed wombats that were hit by cars in Tasmania. Which is those big fucking big hamsters. Thing. Yeah, I mean, I mean hamsters. So they cut them open. What? And basically they figured out that it's intestines. Square what? Modified the shit. Yeah, that's what I'm to saying. To make it square. Yeah. So scientists now can figure out engineering techniques. <laughs> make square cubes. How to make square cubes. From the fuck? From a wombat that makes square shit. Yeah. And these square cubes are two centimeters by two centimeters. Oh, so it's like this? And they thing. shit 100 cubes. And they put them in piles to mark their territories. Wow. Giant piles of cubed shit. So they might, must build up like a blog. It looks like Minecraft. Yeah. But from their ass. Oh, that's amazing. Basically, the doctor said cutting up the wombat was like Christmas. They were so excited. Because the square shit. Because the square shit. Oh, the, the world going crazy. We, sh- we should move to the Mars. Okay, keep going. We should not move to Mars. It's hot. <laughs> we should move to the Mars. It's plus something on the Mars where it's sun, and mm-hmm. it's minus something if it's not sun. Wow. So it's a ridiculous difference between the... <clears throat> you ready for this news? Next news, what I supposed to be ready, ready for news. I don't even know I'm ready, but he said I supposed to be ready. No idea. I have open brain to unbelievable news. <laughs> like if you somebody tell me aliens is in your next room, I'm gonna say, oh well, uh, what he want. <laughs> and now let's. I'm waiting for you. Tell me okay. what I'm ready for. I'm gonna tell you I'm ready or not. Moroccan woman. Okay. I hear this somewhere. Moroccan woman. Kill somebody. Uh, make the fucking juice. <laughs> and fucking drink it. <laughs> and fucking find. And she. Mora- uh, yeah, yeah. Mor- Husband. Yeah, <laughs> holy shit. Chop up, make juice. <laughs> When the woman in Morocco, <laughs> yeah, yeah, basically <laughs> killed. That's why her, I'm not married, man. Killed they her, crazy. killed her lover I and them be and, just. <laughs> and cooked them. I know. So basically, what this woman did. Oh my god! Yeah, I feel bad for this the, husband. The woman served up her boyfriend's remains in a traditional Emirati dish. So it's she... basically like a it's basically like a pile of meat on rice. Oh, that's good. So she made like a beautiful like Moroccan dish I with her me. boyfriend. <laughs> hey, yeah. They said no. They said they find his tooth somewhere. Yeah, they did. That's how they figured it out. Yeah, they said what the fuck is this? So basically, she cooked the boyfriend. <gasps> no, she, she blended. No, no, no. She cooked. Make the shit, yeah, you make the it. nice meatballs yeah, 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 yeah. out of him. <laughs> you put him on some rice. Oh my God, women! All right. So she served him to Pakistani workers in the in the United Arab Emirates. And then they start shitting cubes everywhere. <laughs> so she cooked them. Cook they, him. Yeah, cook them. Cook him. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. No, you cook them. I say cook no, him. No, I'm saying cooking him. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. Cooking him. Yeah, cooking him. <laughs> she made him in a beautiful dish. And went that. to the Pakistan workers. That's part Eat of the... It. Part of the taste. Yeah, she's like, like, chicken. she's like, how's this nice plate of uh, Emirati? Is it good? Yeah, and that's like, what you're usually doing. Uh, what did <laughs> Mustafa make for you? No. What her name is? Uh, I eat shawarma. Which is almost the same. It's just not no the tea. same. It's not the same. You should, every time you go into her house, and say, where's your husband? And if you show up, this means not from him. Not cooked? Okay, that's good. All right, next. You know what makes me laugh, though? What? He's from Morocco. Oh, my God! Good <laughs> he have no... And she's from Morocco, too? No, she's from Israel. Oh, good She's he... from Israel. Good he have no Morocco woman, because that's what happened. You know, you <clears throat> want to hear why she killed him? 
and cooked them. Oh, because he said he, he liked another Moroccan woman. Yeah. Yeah, that's the, that's the <laughs> wrong thing to say. He, he was planning to marry someone else. Oh my god, you know that Morocco woman? You're not in love with her anymore. <laughs> Run away, you became meat pie with the <laughs> doof on the top. <laughs> I'm kidding. Holy shit. Yeah, yeah, I hear this shit. So, that's cut my eye. I'm like, that trick is crazy. So basically, he was telling her, I, I want to marry someone else. And she was like, that's not gonna happen. And she only had five years. And Takeshi have 32. That's ridiculous! <laughs> she made man pie. <laughs> and not like, man pie! And Takeshi just have random shooting on his video. <laughs> and that's it. So basically he was missing for a couple months. No kidding! And then the brother was like, I need to look for this guy. I don't know where he went. So, what about Pi? You want to yeah, try? So, yeah. so the brother... Like my brother. Oh my god, that's gonna be terrible. So the brother was looking for his brother. Oh, that's... I know this story. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Walking around the house, looking <laughs> for him. It was in a city called al Anan. al Anan. al Anan. al Anan. Which is bordered with Omen. Yeah, like you know how this little border between your sack ball and the fucking Mirazzo? <laughs> <laughs> that's the border. And, oh, wow. <laughs> Border where with the country Omen is where Omen oh, they have country? Yes, like that's, Omen, that's like where, big nuts. That's where Vici died in Omen. That's what happened over there. Probably fucking Marco woman make him push through the window. I didn't even know Pakistan was bordered with Omen. I know Pakistan is bordered with the uh Bin Abladen where they with shoot the, him. What about yeah, Bin Abladen? You know the fucking guy. Oh, fucking uh, bin Mustafa bin, bin Laden. Laden. No, Bin Laden. Osama Bin Laden. Oh, la yeah, was shot. was living in Pakistan. Oh, right on the border, his house was. He was living in Pakistan. Yeah, that was terrible. Mm -hmm. They shoot him in the head twice. Yeah. Make sure he's dead. But the brother was looking for his brother. Holy fuck! I feel pain of the brother. I'm so sorry, man, for your loss. And this is where they figured out. Oh man, just <laughs> what I how just I just going in his shoes. He went, I'm ready. Come he, on. He, went, like the, he went in the kitchen. Oh. Fuck. He looked in the blender. Oh. Yeah. And he's like, why is there a tooth <laughs> in the blender? What? He took the tooth and, and checked took DNA? And he took the tooth. And he's like, brother. <laughs> oh, fuck. That's terrible. So the woman basically murdered him, butchered him, put him in a blender. Make the pie. Made the pie. Fing. Served it to Pakistan. United what about, Arab What about workers. these people now that find out they eat the fucking guy? They puke him like crazy, probably. Yeah, but the, they ate him like a couple weeks ago. But they had no idea they ate human. Now they probably all fucked up and need psychology. No, they would just literally be like, I ate human and it wasn't bad. Stop it, they're gonna puke. They probably ate it, and they're like, this is good sauce. It's marinated very well. But that was actually what situation. There was one plane crashing up somewhere in the winter time. And it was a lot of dead people and, and uh, survived people. Okay. And then uh, actually they make decision they're going to fucking cook everything, uh, the dead people. And they, that's what they survived. They eat the fucking dead people okay. before the other guys find them out. But that was unbelievable because you preserve, because it's so cold over mm -hmm. there. Then they make fire. Then they fucking start, you know, these dead people just, you know, they don't get bad. Just, just bad. Yeah. And then they say, okay, let's eat the fat guy. Let's and they make, the yeah, they put them and they eat a little pieces and feed everybody. I think so. It was like on Where the fuck was this? Oh, yeah. That was big, big thing. How they, there was even movie made on this. They have to eat each other <laughs> then they run on the dead people okay now they have to choose the one of them live one because Holy. we got we have to survive Hold on, no mean... no you can't drink more than one no you're gonna have too much buzz <laughs> nice hemp hemp beer hamster beer yeah but you go all organic you, you go and go... healthy that's not good. i'm not going anywhere i have the day off today oh where am i going but you're driving. Uh, driving where? Your car. 
But the brother found the tooth in the blender. Okay. And he's like, she hate my brother. <laughs> okay, so what now after? What do you mean what after? They arrested her. Okay, so that's it? Yeah. All right, next news. Are you ready for this one? This is a crazy week of news. Oh, fuck. What now? You ready? Wait. You gotta meditate. You gotta get ready. All aliens uh, groups send me vibration. <laughs> <laughs> so I can take this very lightly. I just want to say that all these news stories I find are real news stories that you can read online. These are 100% they Real news One, I find a one good connection with this. I'm surprised you knew about the Morocco <laughs> woman <laughs> eating uh, the husband, my, uh, boyfriend. My favorite is square cube shit. <laughs> All right. Man admits to having sex man with admits. The... What do you mean? What do what, slow down? Man admits. What is admits. man admits? Admits. Yeah. What is mit? Like confesses. Oh, he confesses. Say fucking English. No, that is English. <laughs> no, you use the word admit. Uh, never fucking. Oh, he admit yeah. in confession <laughs> that he. That yeah. He was having sex with with a miniature horse. <laughs> <laughs> That's sick people. Why did he fuck miniature horse? <laughs> He fucked his miniature horse. Okay, what the fuck is wrong with him? He can't have a woman? And, but he went to the cops and he's like, I think there's something wrong with me. I keep fucking my miniature horse. <laughs> I, ima I imagine the cop. <laughs> that's, that's it. That's $25. That's $25 fine. It's okay. No, you're fine. $4,000 oh, fine. fuck. They Jew. Well, that's it. I... That's all he had to pay for fucking yeah. his horse. Yeah, but that's his horse. Four Why do you have to pay? But this was the best thing, though. He was ha he, he was having sex with his horse yeah. four times a week. Poor horse. <laughs> he gave but... whole detail how he was fucking his horse. No, it's, I think so. His detail is like this. I Holy put the shit. limo in garage. And then Guess this. how old he was. 21 years old. No, that's usually very horny, guys. And he was fucking his miniature horse, but he said it was okay because he used condoms so he wouldn't catch diseases. <laughs> but I would be scared to even touch the horse because they have like unbelievable herpes and everything. You must be nuts. Even with this condom, you know, like, they disease is so strong, they can even go through the condom. He literally was like, okay, I'm going to wake up, go to the gas station, buy a box of condoms, so I could go and fuck my horse. <laughs> That's amazing. My miniature... Why do you need the condoms, babe? Miniature no, horse. No, my miniature horse need the uh, cleanup. The, the, was he going to get scared that he was going to get the horse pregnant? Imagine with the horse... Kicking the balls? Holy fuck, that's ridiculous. The thing was, they never said in the article if the miniature horse was a female horse or a male horse. I think so. There's no. It was either he was fucking the horse in the ass. That would be gay. Or yeah, that would be gay horse sex. <laughs> no. Like uh, bestiality, gay issues. Well, bestiology is still legal in nine states in the United States. You try, wait, 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 <laughs> clap, clap, clap. You try tell me <laughs> that the people in nine states fucking goats and horses and any kind of bullshit. Not animals, only that. And a hamster with square ass though. Back in the day, there was a website. Website back in the day? What do you mean how back in the day? The website was not a long time well, ago. Well, last time I looked at this website was eight years ago. That was Roughly. the beginning of the internet. And no, not even. <laughs> <laughs> there is a website that explains all the states where you can fuck animals. Why even what fuck animals? What's wrong with you? And well, listen, this is the laws in the United States of America, greatest oh. country in the world. Oh I yeah. Like. Oh, what a nice. Okay, keep talking. So basically, Happy Thanksgiving. 
There was. Do not fuck. You eat turkey. You eat the turkey. You don't no fuck the turkey. No fucking turkey. <laughs> okay, keep going. So this famous. I want you to put the pictures. Find this something. I'm you, not putting pictures. I want turkey. I want the miniature house. Fucking ass. No. I want people see what they can hear. I want it. It's see. a audio show. No, it's video show. Yeah, they just see you going <laughs> like this, fucking <laughs> all the time. You make fun of your fucking blood. But you're listen, bad there, human. There was a website. Call your mother. Ask her how old are you. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't know. Okay. <laughs> okay, keep going. But they would show videos of guys fucking animals. It's better fucking pony and have the boat that on the roof the dark with the kid on the roof in the monkey fucking the country. The two videos that will stick in my mind for the rest of my life. Oh, you watched that? Was one video I never was this either. giant pig fucking the guy in the ass. Pig fucking the fucking guy? Fucking the guy in the ass. What the fuck? And... Uh, Sorry for my And language. then a marine biologist at some like Sea World place. You fucking well. Blowing yeah. the dolphin, giving a blowjob to the dolphin. What the fuck is wrong with the world? And that is on a website that you could go. Oh fuck! Thank you. No. But there is, I believe, there is still like eight to nine states where it's completely legal to do it. Like this guy didn't even go to jail. Literally, the cops are like. Okay, so you fucked your horse. And then he's like, yes, but I used the condom. Okay. You That's... just have to pay a $4,000 ticket. Okay. But he still gets to keep the horse. This horse probably gets <laughs> he still the same day he paid the ticket. Still got the miniature horse on his farm. They didn't take away the horse. Never identified if the horse was male or female. And basically, like, he... Is just like, I have a problem, I'm gonna stop fucking this horse. Somebody just shoot me. <laughs> Why am I wasting time on this news? Okay, next news. Fuck what it. do you mean, wasting time on That's this? That's crazy. There's a new rap battle. Eminem came out? <laughs> no. Usually he rapping. Bow. Okay, keep going. There's a new rap battle. Rap battle! These two rappers. Battle, two rappers! Yo, yo, yo. Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> <laughs> There's this rapper named Joyner Lucas. Joy the Lucas. Rapper number one. He's a big famous rapper. He was featured on Eminem's new album. I'm waiting just for a second, Apple. He was featured on Eminem's new album. He has a song with him called Lucky You on the Kamikaze album. Lucky You by... What? That's what his Eminem name was now? No, no, but what his Joyner name? Joiner Lucas. Join the Lucas, lucky one. Okay. On the Eminem album. He was having the a... last one with the plane. What? Yeah, Kamikaze, with the Kamikaze. Yeah, yeah. alright, we're good. Keep going. And the second rapper, what is gonna be bothered with is Join the Lucas and. And big Toronto rapper Tory Lanez. Tory Lanez? Yeah. How's it go? No, no, it's a guy. Big rapper from Toronto. What he was that? famous for getting kicked out of Holt Renford's store because they looked at him and they're like, you can't afford these clothes. <laughs> and he has money. <laughs> oh, yeah, he's got a lot of money. <laughs> and the security in there is like, why are you looking at this shit? You can't afford it. <laughs> See, that's fucking stereotypes. They yeah, think they went can... full racist on yeah. him. See, like, like, you know what? And that was, we York, to that, was York, that was at York. That was at Yorkdale Mall in Toronto. Oh yeah. yeah. That video. Mm -hmm. It's him and Rolt and uh, Holt Renford, okay. which is where they have Gucci and Louis Vuitton and everything, Ooh. like in that store. Ooh. And he's walking around like a normal person, Ooh. looking. Ooh. Maybe he wants to buy it. And security comes up to him and is like, "You can't afford this shit. Get the fuck out." And he's like, what do you mean? I'm the, one of the biggest rappers on the fucking planet What's from your here. name? Tory Lanez. Listen, Tory. <laughs> Which he has a song with 6 9 She, on his you six... say she. Huh? You just say she. She? No, I didn't. Yeah, Tory yeah. Lanez is a guy. Yeah, but you just say she have a song on there. No, Takashi 6 9 is she. No, Takashi <laughs> is... It's Chris D'Elia's girlfriend. 
No. <laughs> Takashi, good luck, man. I'm waiting. Good things happen to good people, so shut up, Grant. So they had a, a, a rap battle because Tory Lanez was uh, getting mad, basically. Ooh, I'm mad. Because he was getting bad reviews on his new album. Oh, I didn't even know he had an album. Yeah, it's a brand new album that came out. What's his name? It's getting bad reviews. No fucking idea. Hey, Suri. What is Tory Lane's new album? It is Love Me Now. That's fantastic. So, <laughs> yeah, exactly. His new album's called Love Me Now. All right. All right, Tory Lanez. By Tory Lanez. Lanez. Yeah, yeah. From Lander. Toronto. Lander. Lander. Big Toronto Raptor. Rapper. Whoa. Raptor. <laughs> they have, we have nice Raptors in our Toronto rap community. We so have they... a drag and we Tony Lampton. And Cardinal Official. And Tory Lampton. No, not Lampton. Tory Lanez. Lame. So they basically... Tory Lanez was getting mad that he was getting a shitload of bad reviews. Why are you fucking getting mad? Fucking go sing fucking, you fucking pussy. Just fucking, who cares? Why are we sweating today so much? Stop it. Who's swearing? Like we say F word too much. Who's saying F? I think so. We we allowed to have like a five F word per episode. <gasps> a little bit of stuff. There's no limits. We have no advertisements. We are limited by government in the United States. No. Or are we going to go to allow, them life or job? They allow people to fuck miniature horses and just pay four grand no, for fucking them. No, it's not for free, for $4,000. Yeah, it's cheaper to get a hooker. $4,000? You know what's funny? Fucking, no, I don't fucking, a to this fucking a hooker is completely illegal in the States and you could go to jail for it. But fucking a miniature horse, you only have to pay $4,000. Yeah, go fuck chimpanzee. That's, that's how You're going to rip your fucking fuck dick off and put on the roof fucking. <laughs> <laughs> That's in India. Fuck. So they had a rap battle. Okay? That's what they should do it to him. <laughs> Send him to zoo and fuck <laughs> him. Try and fuck the yeah, jet. and then they're gonna fuck. <laughs> and if he does, him. if he does, if he successfully fucks it, they should give him like five hundred thousand dollars. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, some kind of without award. getting his balls ripped off. <laughs> awards for yeah. No, if he get safe, come back home. Yeah. No, then they're gonna send him to lose... gorilla fuck gorilla. <laughs> Silverback. <laughs> level. Every yeah, animal. yeah. And if he, he has this, yeah. they're gonna send him to a rhino so. <laughs> Then you gotta fuck the elephant. <laughs> Why At the that? end. You fuck oh. the elephant, you get ten million dollars. <laughs> I'll have a blowjob from giraffe. <laughs> Like on oh, your second oh, floor, oh, you have a blood There's all different up. levels of your fucking... The government gives you fucking money in the mail for doing yeah. it. Ooh. Holy shit. Ooh. So these two guys in a rap battle. And Tory Lanez is getting mad because he end. thinks he's like the a fucking awesome rapper. Yeah, top but listen, guy. I'm taking him because he's going to be fancy. <laughs> Blow up my <laughs> chin up. <laughs> then if you can pass this... Yeah. What can be higher than this? <laughs> Fuck by bald eagle. No, imagine you get blown by a fucking uh, blue whale. No, but blue whale's in the ground. I'm sorry, giraffe is <laughs> Blue high. whale's in the ground. Now we can put him in bald eagle. Imagine bald eagle fucking. him. Bald eagle is just gonna rip his dick off and fly away. Yeah, that's uh, terrible death. Yeah. yeah. So Tory yeah. Lanez <laughs> and, and Joyner Lucas. Basically ended up having a rap battle because Tory Lanez... Blow by the... Well, how is this going to happen? He you stick to... it in the blowhole. No, he has to... And then it goes... Put... Brrr. You have to fuck the well in his hole. <laughs> yeah. On the orca. You could find them. They're swimming around all over the place. Holy... Oh, did you hear about this? Can the fucking make $85 million for save the orcas now? No, they made it against the law. You can't have whales in captivity anymore in Canada. Well, free really have to go. But in the States, Free I'm going to gonna go. see whale sharks in the Atlanta, Georgia Aquarium. So at least they get to keep them. Orca? No, whale sharks. Oh, whale sharks, we know. That's the very They're biggest shark. They're fucking massive. Yeah, but he plankton. He don't eat Only like fucking aquarium on the planet that has them. That's awesome. I just... 
Make sure you're recording in 4K and 64 by frame. No fucking bullshit. Or if you don't have this, record it 1080p in 60 foot by frame. Yeah, always 4K. No, 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 no. Your 4K is not 4K. What are you talking about? 1080p, 60 foot by frame. The videos that come out now is 1080p, 60 frames per second. That's, that's what the I videos want. that's coming out. Yeah, right yeah. Now. That's but I find out how you're recording with your phone is much better, and you're recording with. I don't know. Like I always watching you, like you was with me uh, and Tia that yeah. day, and uh, yeah, that's the ten eighty. That's thing. the ten eighty p thing. Yeah, but holy shit, for a moment was so nice and and sixty foot by frame. Yeah, that's what I call, but this is different. Sixty frames per second. Yeah, exactly. But uh, was one moment I have like so clear, it's unbelievable. I'm saying, oh, that's so nice. Mm -hmm. Depends how busy we are here. So basically, they had a rap battle. Yeah, Tory so Lanes there's was two thinking. rappers, Tory is Tony, Shimon, and the Tori uh, Wilson. She gonna, and they both gonna... <laughs> <laughs> they're gonna both have fucking rap war. One is from Canada, one is from States. So Tori Lanes and, came out with a rap. Yeah. Then join... the rap name Tap Tap. So Rap Tap. Then Joyner Lucas. Joyner Lucas came out with a rap one hour later. Okay. Dissing him. So he's right. Fuck and him. he got two hundred thousand more listens than Tory Lanez's album, like oh, this track. Okay. And he basically ended the song with like, "We need to make a record together." That's a very good idea. Yeah. Fucking both the good rappers. So basically, Joyner Lucas proved that he is a better rapper Be than uh, Tory Lanez. Uh, before I forget, the best rapper uh, Kanye West just donated to White Fire in California five hundred thousand dollars. Yeah. You can make million. It's unbelievable. No. Why would you donate one million to Fire? No, to the people who now living on a parking lot in Walmart with tents because they have nowhere to go. It's fucking big parking lot now. Mean, it's it's like, a big state. You can go anywhere. I know. They say fucking bullshit. And trust me, the people suffer now. No clothes. Everybody lose. You know, they talking about the Jay Butler or fucking uh, another Jay Butler. fucking Gerard song. Butler. Yeah, uh, Hannah Montana shit. Yeah, Miley Cyrus. Yeah. Yeah. But that's normal. <laughs> people who have no insurance, no nothing. It was blow up and they have nothing. I watched this. Arnold Schwarzenegger is right now over there and say fucking that's bullshit. The people have to live on the fucking parking lot with the fucking tents. It's ridiculous. There's nowhere to go. No houses, no nothing. They have to sleep in the parents, somebody parents couches or go to different states and they live on somebody couches and maybe find a job. There's no jobs, no nothing. It's, it's fucking, honest to God, your America Trust me, you're America from honest society. It's beautiful and it's fucking bullshit. Worse than Russia in worse time. I was driving over there, big cities, okay, I get, I get it, fucking fancy shit. Small city, oh my god, just shoot me. You don't want to live there. Poor country. I drove to the States, it wasn't bad. Because you always go too fast, you don't see shit. No, I, I, went, I went through Walnut, Iowa. Like that's small. I'm I'm never gonna forget that name. Walnut? Walnut, Iowa. You went through the Walnut. I went through cities in Colorado. Very nice. Avon. I think it was called Avon, Colorado. Yeah, that's what this. And uh... small towns there. Yeah, I like Aspen. From Dumb and Dumber. S small towns in Utah and but fuck Utah, in southern Utah. You went in circles over there. No, I went in circles in Colorado. I got oh, lost. Okay. I went four hours the wrong way. And then he came back to the same spot saying, that looked the same when I started it. No, and then I went through the Rocky Mountains and I'm like, holy shit, I'm driving through Rocky Mountains right now. I'm like, this is fucking trippy. And scary. Yeah. But finally, French boy was killed for not doing his homework. French Montana is dead? I didn't say French Montana was dead. Who is that? French boy. Like the normal boy from France? France. Got killed yeah. for not doing his homework. By who? So, the French boy got you killed. You try tell me. What? 
the fucking square shit from hamster holy shit and fucking guy who fucked the miniature horse will be known on our program <laughs> No, they will be. It's okay. still going. Okay, okay. But what is saying? Like, what is total time? <sighs> 55 minutes. Oh, so it's gone. So it's okay. Okay, keep going. So now... So basically, four members of his family got arrested for beating him to they, death. Uh, let's remind them. Maybe we didn't get it over there. So that's a French guy from France. Little guy gets sh- killed because he didn't do his homework. Yes. And by his four members of the family who yeah. are... Who beat him with a broom. Yeah, but who family? Beat him. Mother, but, father, like they and grabbed and a broom uh-huh. and started hitting him with like a broom handle. Like beat him with a broom. Broomsticks. Yeah, like a broomstick. And they oh, fucking fuck, beat the shit out of him until he died. He literally went to cardiac arrest and died. That's fucking nuts. That's how sh- show you. You know what? Life is the pressure gift you ever have. Fuck the school, fuck everybody. Mm-hmm. Fucking, you're not gonna be the kid because he fucking what? Didn't, didn't want to do his homework. Fuck the shit. What are people stupid? That's why I'm no go to France, man. They idiots over there. Right? They were literally gonna have a meeting in France with the government talking about if kids should be smacked still in France or not. You know who should be smacked? Who? France from Europe. They should be fucking. Kick out this is where it happened. Stupid fucking French people. Yeah. No excuse to all French people, but that's stupid people from your country. That's ridiculous. You should be happy you have kid. Fuck the school. You just you know like people like horses, like I said, like cops. They follow the stupid rules. Sometimes you have to say, wait a second. What is good for my family and everything? Fuck everything else. And that's it. Mm-hmm. And you make decision on this. Unbelievable. People are so stupid. Like freaking. You should fucking always step back and see what who your family is. You're the closest circle. Then is your workers or something else circle. Then is your country. Then is this other country. So what are you doing first? First you Take care, you're the closest circle. So what happened if your son say, hey man, I messed up with homework. Okay, fuck it, that bad, but don't do it again or are we gonna stick you up? And then he say, okay, awesome. That's marijuana, Bill? Hmm? Why is marijuana picture? <laughs> <laughs> That's uh-huh. marijuana beer? No. You bastard, you drinking marijuana beer? It's hemp. What is hemp? <laughs> what is this fucking thing? This what is this? What hemp? What, what is this? Ask Siri what hemp is. Hey Siri, what is hemp? Hemp or industrial hemp, typically found in the northern hemisphere, is a variety of the cannabis scent of the plants. You bastard <laughs> cannabis shit! You alcoholic and at the same time <laughs> butthead. <laughs> <laughs> Pat, Carrie, work, Shaq. Shaq. What? It's gonna. Calling it's calling him. No, no. Hang no, up. No, no. <laughs> You're calling people. What? It's just beer. Seven dollars for a four pack. You have something? Let me try. Okay. It's organic too. It's sm- It tastes terrible. What do you mean it tastes terrible? It's like not beer, it's like fucking old sacks. <laughs> it's very, compared to this beer, it's like fucking water. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he is drunk and high at the same time. You walk home, ma. Who's walking? You. You fucking gonna make... Major problems for traffic in this fucking country. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody! Gobble, 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 everybody. Gobble, gobble. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Gobble de gobble! Alright, so tonight was... What? Tonight? Last Next week was gonna be last of our show. No, it's not. This is the last show. 76? 76. That's and we're big. gone for three weeks. Two weeks, you said. Three weeks. No, no you gone for three weeks? No, like this show, three weeks, no show. 
Holy shit, we right before New Year's Eve or something. It's gonna be right before Christmas we come back. Oh, we're gonna have Christmas special. When we come back. Yeah, we're gonna have the prices. What? No prizes? <laughs> you can't afford this prizes. Joke. Second year, I say the same thing. No prizes. No prizes. This What's guy is so Jewish. It's ridiculous. Ask him, can I borrow $20? No. See? That's not what <laughs> always like this. <laughs> He's so Jewish. It's a thing. Oh. I'm dying. Can I borrow twenty dollars? No. I'm Here you go. Okay. On this beautiful moment, yeah, we say hello to all our fans and stop fucking miniature horses <laughs> and press the like us and like us. Yeah, like us. Okay. <laughs> bye bye.